Hi there, Gulf Fanatics. Andrew Rice, Director of Instruction at the Western Savannah Harbor Resort here today. We all know the feeling. Hitting a good approach shot, wasting strokes on the green via poor speed control. Today I'm going to help you with that. My name is Lydia. My name is Henrik. My name is Eric. And for me. And for me. And for me. So here we are on the ninth green at Savannah Harbor. You would normally do this obviously on the practice putting green, but I wanted to share some insight pertaining to what I believe to be the most important skill when it comes to putting. Certainly for the everyday golfer, the most important skill is the ability to control that speed, the speed at which the ball departs, leaves the club face. How good are we at being able to set this ball in that spot, that spot, that spot? And so I've got a super little drill. I would love for you to practice. You need a little bit of stuff to be able to do it, to execute it, but 10 golf balls, a tee. I've got about 10 feet of space between the tee and my two alignment rods that you can see on the ground there that are gonna create this little bit of a gate. And then I've got 30 feet from my gate to the fringe, to the edge of the green. And the objective here, a ladder drill. Great fun, a good challenge. I'm gonna challenge each of you to see if you can get 10 putts inside that 30 foot space, but there are conditions. Here we go. So obviously the first putt, we're gonna to try to see if we can just fit it through the gate, not too far, because the harder I hit it, the more space I'm gonna burn up. So, okay, there's one ball. And then the way this goes is, I wanna to try to see, that's pretty good. If I can continue working up the ladder, I wanna climb the ladder. And so each putt I hit is gonna be six inches, ideally, maybe even less, six inches beyond the previous putt. And that's how I wanna keep going. Oh, I'm on a good trend, three. And you wanna work your way all the way up to 10. The goal? certainly is to get 10 and we start short and work longer. If you need to clear some of these balls out of the way, feel free to go ahead and take a break and do that. I think that might even be a good thing. But once you've got 10 going away from you, I want you to start coming towards you. Okay. And all the while we're building up that skill, that ability to be able to control the speed. I'm a big believer. Look, putting is three things. Green reading, start line, and I believe the most important one to be speed control. We can save a tremendous number of putts by working on speed control. We know that we're simply just not, we're not gonna make many 20 footers, 20 plus footers, just the facts of physics state that we're not gonna make that many. But I do know this, if we can, every time we're outside 20 feet, cozy that ball up there, tap it in, move to the next tee, we're in good shape. We're not wasting strokes. We're not getting demoralized. Hopefully, you can get out and practice this exercise. It's something you can do at home. It's something you can do at the golf course. Put it down the hallway. Put it down that carpet in the hallway. Develop that skill at controlling how fast the ball is coming off the putter face. You're going to do better on the greens. You're going to shoot lower scores. You're going to have more fun. Thanks so much for watching. If you do have any questions, leave them below. I'll respond to as many as I can.